heard you into gospel music. So mm -hmm. how did you get into that? Really, I like I deepened my faith when I was in high school. Like mm -hmm. I started really growing in my faith. And then like during COVID, I would listen to a lot of gospel music because mm -hmm. I, I feel like I was just at home, sitting at home. And yeah. Read my Bible, read my devotionals, started to grow in my faith more. And then I just, I don't know, it was like Marvin Sapp for me is like a lot of R&B bass. Mm -hmm. I love the choir sound. Yeah. I love like just the way that it sounds mixing while it's gospel music. Mm -hmm. So... I don't know. I really got into it. I would say the past couple of years, just it's yeah. very. It brings me peace, especially yeah. before games, and like yeah. gets me in touch with my with my face side. Yeah. Whenever my phone get working, you gotta send me a playlist. You feel me? I, I'm really, I got a gospel playlist. You gotta send it to me. I really been getting. I'm not gonna lie. I really been getting deeper into my faith too. Like I literally was just talking to my cousin about it. We were just talking about you know just growing more into my faith, reading my Bible more. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? That's really important to me. So yeah, you gotta send me that. Okay. Who's your favorite gospel artist? Marvin Sapp. Marvin Sapp. Mine, I like um, I like Maverick City. Yeah, that, I be listening, that group is great. Yeah. Bro, I be listening to that a lot. I actually want to do something like that, like with like a gospel artist and do like a rap. Like I feel like that would be that would be that would be fire, tough, right? Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. I want to do that. I'm probably gonna make that happen. But yeah, I, I probably had promises on repeat. Gyra. I got I got some I got some songs. I gotta mm -hmm. I gotta share it with you. I ain't gonna count. 